The Free National Movement is responding to reports that two of the party's members of, members of parliament could tender their resignation soon. The speculation surrounds 8 Mile Rock MP Verna Grant and Clifton MP Kendall Wright. All of this as general elections loom. Clint Watson has more. We learned late Tuesday from well-placed sources that 8 Mile Rock MP Verne Grant does not plan to resign at this time from the Free National Movement. However, no word though on Clifton MP Kendall Wright. Both individuals have decided not to discuss the matter in the media or give credence to stories circulating in the media. However, as news broke about this story, Chairman of the Party, Carl Bethel, spoke with ZNS News. At the time, he said he didn't receive any communication to confirm reports that either MP wanted to separate from the party. The party has not received any um, communication or letter from either of the, the MPs and um, to the best of my information neither is the Speaker of the House. <laughs> Let me say that you know um, that we, we wish them well of course but we'll, we'll move on. You know, this is very speculative because I've not heard anything officially and I, neither is Speaker. However, based on his comments, it was evident that there is some rift or sorts in opinion between the party and the two MPs who spoke out in House last week during the debate on the Boundaries report. After it was revealed that their constituencies would be eliminated in the new 38-seat count. They, as members of the party, always had the opportunity, as others did, if they heard any rumors out there about their seats or had any concerns, to make a call to the party leader, prime minister, and say, what's happened? So I, I find it strange that neither of them avail themselves of that very simple right that a party member has. And then we end the election game, and all really with just some renaming of seats, and slight boundary shifts. Um, then they, they took it in a harsh way. But that is their right, and um, we respect their right to make their own political decisions in getting into the House of Assembly they got in on an FNM ticket and um, but if that's their decision that's fine the party will respect their decision and move on. Nonetheless Bethel says should things end up this way he doubts it will negatively impact the governing party. No we don't we, we, we've been through this before in the free national movement and uh, we don't feel that uh, that um, you know such actions if they were to occur would negatively affect the party um, going into an election. Uh, the, the party uh, is very resilient, and um, we think we've governed well. We think that we can run on our record of achievement for the people. Um, you know, political parties are what they are. They are collections of human beings. And sometimes, you know, as we, as we say in the Bahamas, even teeth and tongue does fall out. So, uh, you know, when these things occur, the party just has to show that it is respectful enough of other people and mature enough to move on, move on from these little issues. And I, I'm satisfied that that is exactly the case with the free national movement. Clint Watson, ZNS News.